Hello, church. It's Pastor Jeremy coming to you from the Parsonage with another daily devotion. Today, Leanne Link is going to share a bit about what's keeping her going right now, and she's going to let us know what her grandbaby Julia has been up to. Hello, Core Street family. Leanne Link here. I want to share with all of you um, some of the things that are really helping me through this time of separation from each other. Um, I know that I really enjoy reading and can get lost in books or news articles for hours at a time, but uh, I think some of that is just um, avoiding cleaning out that pesky closet uh, that's been needing to be done for a long time. And um, anyway, um, I need to tell you that you, Court Street, friends and family, um, are what are really helping me keep me going. Um, Our fabulous weekly church services and our devotional times help to put a tiny dent in my calendar each week. Um, My family Zoom time has been fun for some laughs, like uh, where's the grid view? Or um, how do I turn on the microphone? And how do the kids just type in comments? Um, How did we just spend two hours on a Zoom conversation and all we did was laugh and I don't know whether we talked about anything or not. Um, But those are a lot of fun. Uh, Those video chats and texts from family. um, And I have to admit, Facebook posts Um, of family activities of church members uh, and friends at home. Those science experiments, those game nights, um, cooking, playing outside, relaxing after a difficult school assignment, um, whether that was the teachers grading them or the children trying to participate in them, um, the dancing and the singing, um, then on and on. Uh, Those cartoons and inspirational quotes, history, joys, concerns, um, and just hi or thumbs up or a smiley face on Facebook. Um, I also can't leave out our um, beautiful little granddaughter, Julia, with whom I've been able to spend some time because I've been babysitting a couple of times a week um, since her parents have been working outside the home. Uh, I know that you'll be thrilled um, to hear how she has found her voice, uh, learned to clap, uh, give the evil eye, uh, crawl, and call for mama and dada. But all of these things make me smile. And I think that even when we are not sure what to say to someone or how to react to someone, with a post or from a phone call, um, a kind word or a smile is important because it warms the heart of the giver and of the receiver. Um, So even behind a mask, we can learn to share a smile with our eyes and with our thoughts. And let's all just keep on smiling. Let's share some prayer. Dear God, thank you for all you provide for us daily. We thank you for our connections to the church and each other. We thank you that we can connect with one another and make each other smile. You know what we're concerned about and we thank thank you that you are willing to take on our burdens. Help us all to reach out to each other and to you. Help us to work together to keep each other safe and healthy. Help us to be present with each other, even from the safety of our homes. Grant us guidance, grace, and peace. Amen. Till we meet again, Court Street, keep on smiling. Thank you, Leanne, for those words of encouragement. We're glad that you've been getting to spend some virtual time with the baby. If Leanne said something that gave you comfort or resonated with you, let her know in the comments. 
You can find a new devotion here each day right around noon. Until we meet again, keep washing your hands, stay at home, and do not be afraid.